Well, if you were concerned about the Cheviac after its demise on Sky Hill when Jen jumped it, it's a couple weeks later and I'm finally getting around to fixing it. Nothing actually happened to it other than a bent frame. And the drain cock got ripped out of the rad and that's why all the fluid ran out. Yeah, as you can see the bent doors or the space and on both sides you can see the bowed frame sticking down. But she should be all fine and ready to go. No worries. Simpler than I thought. Well that was simple enough. Nothing that a little torch and a bit of solder couldn't fix. Now ready to put it back in. Well, now that the old Cheviac has been fixed and come back to life, let's see if the new Cheviac is going to start so I can cut the grass underneath of it. It hasn't been started in two months. So it's an old start, cold start. It's only 20 degrees Celsius out. No bees anyways. That's good. I guess bees don't like blue. Oh, it's hot in here. Well, we'll see if, to see if the battery kept the charge. Carburetor's probably all dried up anyways. A bit of pumpage. It's, now it's refilling the carb. A little more. Battery's good. Oh, sweet. What a great car. Doesn't even stall. Can't believe nobody's bought the thing yet. Other than some peeling paint. Pretty damn hard to find one this nice of shape in Canada this old. No smoke. No bees. No noise. And all the toys. Doesn't even stall after sitting two months. Cool. Never get up to start that thing. It's been a long time for that one. Brake lights on because there's a leak in the rear brake line, but typical for old cars. Huh, perfect. It didn't kill the grass too bad. Ooh, look what we have lurking there. Let's test her out. Well, this one hasn't been sitting as long, so let's see what happens. Grass isn't too grown in. Oh, this is the 83 Pontiac Cheviac. The car might not be dried up. Oh, it isn't. Sweet. Will it just drive away too without stalling? Oh, awesome. Great old cars. <laughs> Gotta love your big old Chevy anyways. Uh. Hmm, well back to bed, try something else. Cool. Sure is collecting apples. Wonder why. So the only other repair I had to do to this beast after the massive air was just adjust the shifter linkage that's underneath the car that goes the automatic transmission from the steering column. Because since the frames bent, it threw it out of whack and you couldn't have park, you only had reverse. <laughs> that was no good. So even if you started, it started taking off. So I think it's gonna start. She always does. It hasn't been started since that jump. Actually, since the day we drove it back after that jump. Oops, it's going to start. A little bit of chokage. Oh, maybe too much. What the hell? It's teasing me. Try no choke. Come on! <clears throat> it just fired! Full choke. Okay. 
a little bit less. Took took all the way off. Forgot. Right, the hood down. We'll go for a ride. Well, you can't kill a Chevy, that's all I can say.